What's going on, everybody? This is Brian from stinkerfalls.com, and we're going to do a little side-by-side. -side. I guess you can say this is a comparison of the alternate versus the regular Motorsport Air Jordan 4. Now, I couldn't find my bread pair. Um, I wanted to throw that in here as well. So I still might do a video on that later, and if you want to see that, just leave a comment below or hit the video with a thumbs up. But um, as you can see, the color, the color combination of the two... Um, is obviously different so I'm not gonna really talk too much about that but what I will say is I believe that the shape it looks better on the regular I'll just call it the white alternate or the white motorsport um, you can see the tongue this one kind of curves which I like and this one just kind of like flat um, but one thing that definitely takes it for me is the material used on the alternate the black edition so you like in the previous video you can see like how plush that is and then uh jordan brand decided to use not that great of leather on this one it's not plush at all it's like it's like almost like that fake leather kind of another thing i noticed was like around the cars see how bulky that is like how big but again you're also getting plush materials up top you see how that kind of goes in like that and some can say it's because it's laced you know up top but I just undid these so it's not like they've been loose enough for so long but other than that I mean we have You see the hill, kind of like the bulkiness of it. That's the only thing I dislike about them. But other than that, if I had to pick, I'm going with the alternate edition just because they do remind me of the bread fours, but blue. The inside of the tongue. I'll show you real quick. Everything's flipped upside down. And as far as the craftsmanship goes, I mean, it's hit or miss on both pairs. So, in my opinion, that's going to be about the same. There was one other thing. Um, I think it was the netting. Yeah. I don't know if it's just me or the netting looks a little bit slimmed down on the alternate. Versus the regular motorsport uh, I'll show you the medial side of this pair I apologize if it seems like I'm rushing through this I'm not meaning to it's just I got to get these back before eight and I'm not sure if that's gonna happen I hope so but I still have to hit on everything so here is the soul of the motorsport Yeah, for me, I'm I'm just picking um, the alternates for sure. I just feel like, I don't know, the black base. And they didn't do the Motorsport, the white edition. They didn't do it right. They used this quality leather. That'd be one thing if they added the Mars head at the hill. This is for the alternate. And this is, or I'm sorry, this is for the, um, the, just the regular motorsport. And this is for the alternate. Even the, the insole is a little bit, um, a little thicker. And actually it feels like it has more padding in it. So like they did, as for quality, they did better on these. And now color combination for me, I'm going with the the alternate. Now, if they put the quality on this pair and had the Mars head at the back, I'd go with this pair just because I remember seeing it back when it was like just given out to the motorsport team. And yeah, I, I really wanted those. So, and I did not have the money, not nearly enough money. But leave a comment below and let me know 
what pair do you pick? Is it the alternate or the regular motorsport? Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to sneakerfalls.com. And if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe.